You know something, I'm always proud to welcome this next brother to the stage. He has personally been an inspiration to me. His brilliant, groundbreaking comedy opened doors and paved the way for a whole new generation of today's black comedians. So everybody, if you would, please welcome to the stage. Show your love for the one and only Mr. Paul Mooney. Show your love, everybody. Hey, okay, Apollo, 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 Apollo. This, this is the joint. This is it. This is black heaven. This is it. This is it. Well, I'm here to talk about white folks. I want to talk about white people because this hasn't been a very good year for white people. Between Heaven's Gate and Taggerwood, it's been rough. It's been a rough year. Heaven Gate, Heaven's Gate. You know, you do remember Heaven's Gate. You saw the crazy leader, follow me, follow me, follow me. When white folks get crazy, they always go to Jesus. Jesus, I'm Jesus, I'll be back in three days. It's been six months, he ain't coming back. 39 crazy white people, just crazy. When I found out two black people were involved, I was sick for two weeks. Two dumb black people trying to follow the Brady Bunch. You can't get a job on Earth. Why would you want to go to Venus? <laughs> and of course, the news tried to make the white folks smart. You know that. The media. Oh, they were very clever. They were with the internet. Yes, I know. <laughs> dot, dot, dead. <laughs> they were stupid. This Tiger Woods stuff is too much for me. See, I don't like Tiger Wood, and I don't care what you say. You know why I don't like him? Because he don't want to be black. He don't want to be black, and I don't like him. Tiger Wood is black. I don't know about the space program, but I know somebody black when I see him. Just because he upset that golf, because white folks worship golf. I don't like golf courses. They look like a plantation. I'm from the South. I, I get mad every time I see one. But he upset that, so they're upset about it. They want to share him. He's copper collision, he's this, he's that, one third, one fourth. If he'd have robbed the bank, what would he have been? A nigga, that's what he'd have been. They robbed the bank. They wouldn't have said they're looking for a copper collision. I like Tony the Tiger better than I do Tiger Wood. At least Tony knows he's white. Great! You don't hear Tony talking crazy. I'm one-fourth panther, I'm one-third lion, I'm one-eighth cheetah. And what is all this Ebonics? It's supposed to be something from East Africa, you know. She be good, she all the kind of... We supposed to have got it from the Africans. I've asked my African friends, they don't even remember. I don't remember, I don't remember. I have enough trouble being a black man, I don't want to be bilingual too. Leave it to the Mexicans, I don't want to be bilingual. This is standard English, and I speak, I think we speak it pretty damn well on the books. I'm serious. On the books in America, they had laws that if you taught somebody black to read or write, you went, you got the death penalty. They'd kill you for doing that. So us to get over that hurdle, I think we speak this English pretty well. This is a foreign language for us. This is not our native tongue. I think we speak it real good. Ebonics. And if we do mess it up, it's white folks' fault. I've done my research on it at the library. It's their fault. Because we copied them. Remember? Remember the pirates? Remember the pirates? You know how pirates talk. Pirates used to hijack the slave ships. And you know how they talk. There she be. I be the pirate. <laughs> and we just copied them. And I be the slave. <laughs> Where's me booty? That's where we got booty call from. <laughs> I know you think I'm cool, don't you? <laughs> I'm just, I'm just having fun. <laughs> Look, I'm going to cut this because we have five or six minutes. I don't want to over my time. I just want to say this. Look, I want you, don't have no fear. Don't get in no bag. They stay on me all the time for doing racial jokes. Like she's squirming and hopping and running. See, we are not like them. We enjoy, we have a sense of humor. We let it out. We don't get uptight. Because I've seen white audiences. I'm being serious. I've studied them. They'll laugh at everything when it's not about them. They fall out. Whoa! Whoa! When it's about them, their whole body, everything changes. Get a damn 
same sense of humor. That's why they're giving O.J. Simpson such a bad time. They tried to take that trophy. That man earned that trophy. Forget about the trial. With his sports, they won his trophy, but they didn't get it, did they? He hid it. He hid that trophy where he hid them shoes and that knife. They ain't gonna never find that trophy.